This is Jerry with Omnivore Blade Works, and it's uh, middle of June. I've been working on a Taipan Tama thingy, and it's sheath. This was um, basically an afterthought because I designed this Tama thingy, which is a one hand tomahawk, which has a nice whittling wide blade bevel on one side, and then a kind of a ripping false edge on the back with a strong spike and a sharp hook and a pretty strong um, axe edge and mohawk edge. Interesting features. You can thrust with it, you can chop with it, you can even do like a right hook uh, strike with the mohawk edge as well as any other um, smashing and bashing techniques you'd want to use with this big D guard. I have the strut in the middle here so that if you happen to hit something hard it won't can only rotate in your hand to to a certain point so you don't lose control of it or or uh, get wrapped up inside of the guard with your whole hand. So the the sheath that I've been working on is a I'm, well making the jig is part of the part of the big deal. Um, in order to get a a tomahawk to draw when you have hooking features you have to figure out where you might need spacers and where you might need um, you know protect to protect your user and where you might need to have um, the whole thing come out so hopefully this will work this spacer in the back is probably going to just be a, a straight spacer so that this hook is not the spike area is not constrained because it looks like it wouldn't be able to go in if that was the case. Um, then these standoffs are for malice clips and they'll be molded on either side of the sheath and um, be able to use malice clips to, to mount this to either a pack or a uh, drop leg panel um, and then draw it basically straight up and out and the um, ride the axe edge along the space my card of spacer here which will allow you to kind of draw as you pull out and then there will be a, a locking pin in this rear hilt hole and then probably also use a, a snap that will go over the handle up into one of these holes where there'll be a, a fastener that way you'll have a, a quick snap um, holder as well as locking pin which could have bungee cord on it so if you really want good retention you can keep the pin on there and then when you're ready to rock and roll you think you're going to use it for a while you can take the pin out put it into another pin hole to on the back side of the sheath to keep it from rattling and then use your thumb strap instead so I'm going away for the weekend but this is the first priority on Monday to get this molded and get this first type hand shipped out to its new owner and I have three more which will um, be ready to go as soon as I make these sheaths um, and then I guess I have some some tomahawks that I need to ship out as well um, a couple of guys are waiting on Anubis tomahawks there's one of the first ones up there dummy prototype I made my sign out of anyway no, you can't. You can't have the big wooden one. That's that's. I'm gonna keep that one. All right. I hope you guys are having a nice, cool summer, and um, see you next time.